This is breaking news from News Channel 11. Breaking news tonight, an event called a Stand Against Racism March is underway on the East Tennessee State University campus in Johnson City. Thanks for joining us at 6. I'm Sarah Diamond. And I'm Josh Smith. Good evening. Participants are showing support for East Tennessee State University men's basketball coaches and team members after they kneeled during the national anthem, triggering criticism. Today, Tennessee Governor Bill Lee became the latest political leader to criticize the team, saying it creates divisiveness. Ansley Daniel joins us live from the march. Ansley? Josh and Sarah, the group stepped off about 15 minutes ago before stepping off and marching. As you can tell behind me here, they talked a little bit about the backlash that the basketball team has received in the last week. They were all telling me that they wanted to come out here to support the students. They say that is the main thing after this past week, as lawmakers and other community members have kind of stood um, against what they did at the basketball game in Chattanooga last week. Again, there are several hundred people here on ETSU's campus, and as you can tell, they're moving pretty quick, but quite a diverse group here. I've seen people with alumni shirts, I've seen students, and several faculty members coming out to this student led protest. Now, this was organized by a group of graduate students in the counseling department. Some of them telling me that it was coming after a classroom discussion yesterday, and all just kind of coming around quickly with other community groups kind of supporting and helping to spread the word on this. Now, I'm told that they are going to kneel in front of the library once they get there, but as you can tell, this group is quite large, so not sure exactly what time that's going to take place, but we do expect them to stop within the next few minutes. But for now, live on ETSU's campus in Johnson City, Ansley Daniel, News Channel 11.